drilling site that they call the Thomas Wild Site by Candy Hills Park. It's incredibly noisy today. They've started the fracking process. They're injecting chemicals and water into the well at high pressure. It's extremely loud. Wouldn't want to be living by that. I'm going to go uh, walk down by the freeway and get closer, where it's going to have to be way louder. I'm looking at uh, smoke coming up out of whatever they're doing, which uh, Don Young warned me about earlier today, so I don't know what I'm going to be breathing when I get down there. It looks like uh, smoke. I don't think it's steam. It's too, too hot to be steam. They're polluting the air with something. Can't be good. Closer now. You can see that smoke really clear. It's, it's gotten a lot noisier. And I'm going to try and get closer. There was a cop guard in this place when we first got here, but I think he saw us coming. He didn't want me to take a picture. I'm looking in the sun now, so I don't know how clear this is going to be. Kind of in the path of whatever this smoke is. It smells kind of bad, and I think it's irritating my eyes. I'm probably being a big fool breathing this, breathing this in, but I've probably been breathing it in for couple years now anyway, without knowing it. Pipeline, well actually three of them you see here, it wasn't here a week ago or so when I was here. It appears to go through a culvert underneath Interstate 30, likely to the Trinity River where they're sucking water out and pumping it here, not paying anybody for it. Follow the pipeline, goes right up to the Chesapeake Energy drilling site. It continues to put off a lot of smoke and make a lot of noise and apparently use up a lot of Trinity River water. I wonder why they don't pay for it. it seems like I'd be stealing just to stick a pipeline in the water and suck a huge volume of water out. But what do I know? It's really putting off a lot of smoke now. I don't know if you can see it. I think I'm going to get out of here.